up what up what up it's your girl rachel back at it with another video you know how we do it so this video is about the ycc vlog which is the um redeemed christian church of god um texas convention we have it every year in june and this is going to be my video about it so i am part of the ycc group which is the choir that ministers doing the convention and this video is mostly about my experience through that kind of point of view you know what i mean thank you for watching subscribe comment yeah, like yeah, drive she that car so that she can sit i know right she knows what she's doing So if y'all don't know if you're new to my um, channel, I'm from Boston. Well, from Lynn specifically. Um, but I took off from Boston, um, Logan Airport. So you could download their app, whatever um, terminal is going to let you know what terminal you're going to be with seat. So this shows my boarding pass and it's just easier than um, getting the printed paper and stuff like that. I have the app, so I just have the barcode show. Um, it's just easier so that's just a picture of how that looks like if you want more information i can make a video about that so the ride there was smooth and it was about three to four hours never again will i walk 25 minutes to get food in texas this is not ma this is not new york hell all no. my pain was because of panda express never again would i decide to walk 25 minutes to a restaurant in Texas. So after settling down with my dad, my grandma, my cousin, Abisola, my brother Enoch, we just went out to eat. And soon after, someone in the choir came to pick me up from my hotel so we could, um, okay. so I guess, get to have a get together. How's the food doing? Is it ready for us to devour? Is it? No. Jesus. No. <laughs> Y'all, 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 this is Jason's house. He lives in a freaking mansion. You guys do not understand. Dream house, hashtag goals, hashtag how many bathrooms and what? rooms and closets. Like, literally, like, not okay. Like, two, like, living rooms or whatever. They have a freaking movie room. I'm moving two dining rooms like i'm confused look at those stairs i'm just moving off oh, this is huge this is ridiculous i'm literally losing my mind i'm moving to texas it's official if it's not for the See, y'all get to see the backstage of what's happening behind scenes of the choir. Y'all already know. Just getting into practicing, getting into the mood. Then soon after, we were trying to figure out what movie to watch. We tried watching Lionheart, and then we just watched scary movies, and people started screaming. <laughs> Early in the morning, in the morning. It was literally one of my highlights because we just had a lot of fun and yeah we were just like on the floor watching movies and screaming it was hilarious um and then we had to leave and go to practice nope that's wrong <laughs> and what do we do yeah next day practice at like nine so we had to leave and start practicing I'll put in mind that I spent four days instead of three days because convention started on Wednesday. I came on Tuesday, so just so you're not confused, this is the first day of convention. So this is the Wednesday. So yeah, the choir got a hotel. One room for the guys, one room for the boys. Yeah, one room for the girls, one room for the guys. And yeah, I wasn't there the whole time. I was fully. I spent one night, which is the last night, because my dad left before I did. So I spent the last day which was on friday with them it was a really nice hotel it was really lit we had a lot of fun at the hotel um yeah uh, you're so famous <laughs> you're so famous Ooh. And follow me on Instagram. You're gonna have to snap chat. Hey, yeah. Hey. 
All right, so this is Thursday, African night. That's why we have our traditional wear on. Um, we're just in the hotel chilling. Um, this is after practice, before the actual praise and worship, and everything starts. You look upset. Did I follow you? I think so, yeah. It's a monotone, but Nigerians, we start high and we always end low. It's like, I am going to the store. <laughs> to purchase a new You see what's happening? It starts high and you gotta slide down. It gotta be so. I am going to the store. You know what I'm saying? I just love our people. Let me, let me do this poem before I get in trouble. I went out of time. All right, so this artist is what uh, you can find him on Instagram, um, Words by Zico. Um, he t he's Nigerian, so he talks about his wedding, talks about poetry, um, he talks about a lot of things. You can look him up on Instagram again. I'm pretty sure he has a YouTube channel. I saw that on his Instagram, so y'all could check him out. I'm gonna put the um, like the name below this video, <laughs> and yeah. Oxymoron in the history of mankind. Almost. But as far as this world's concerned, you can live your life foul and can almost get away with murder if you have a nice smile. You can almost meet folks just to almost sleep around and stop by at your local clinic where you almost have a child. But see, almost is no stranger to Satan. Here's proof. See, Satan only tells lies when they're almost the truth. And it's amazing. In our incompleteness, we find complacency. But if almost is one of Lucifer's many traits, then somehow we inadvertently become good at Satan impersonations. But on the contrary, Christ did his job fully, and he proved he was God when he died on the cross like it was his duty. And to pardon my iniquities that I committed rudely, he resurrected from the grave just to tell death to excuse me, but excuse me. And we have over here, OMG, it's Wande, y'all already know, she has reached, reach records, <laughs> you get it? Rich records, no? Okay, anyways, so yeah, she's a um, rapper. We got praise and worship, y'all already know. It's working, it's working, it's So this is YCZ, 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 YCZ. Y'all already know how we do it. YCZ, Look at that suit. Yeah, we're just fooling around here. It's a video of us having fun the hotel, being kids, even though we're not really children like that. But they were being children. So. <laughs> yes. You can literally be funny. So yeah, Onaga is the top song of the week. I'm pretty sure this is the last day, so this was Friday.
So what do I like best about YCC and the convention is being in the atmosphere of prayer, being in the atmosphere of praise and worship, and being surrounded by people who love and want to know God more. Um, it pushes me to do better. It pushes me to have a close relationship with God. Um, that was one of our big topics, to di dif differentiating between relationship with God and religion. And I really appreciate our topics, our discussions, being so open and being so... I always feel like I can trust and be open and be myself. And I really appreciate that about the convention. And it always brings me closer to God and gets me ready for the next year. You know, especially school year because June, then August, we start school. And I just, I just love it. It's also a reminder that there is God and because you're able to encounter God's presence and study God word and you know what i mean i don't know if i could really under, like explain this in words like i definitely always feel like i've been touched or i've been in god's presence it makes a difference and as i said it really does get me ready for another year it's just a it encourages me and pushes me and keeps me focused on the path where i want to go and where i want to be you know what i mean this is about the end of the video so i still till saturday um because my flight wasn't until 6 p.m my cousin was 5 p.m so we went to the pool at the hotel and we just relaxed till we had to go to the um airport and we had a little we okay so our car was damaged tires so we had to kind of wait get an uber and then there was some we missed our flight. We had the airport for a whole day. Till the next morning, luckily we were able to get into the flight that they told us was full. And I got home on Sunday at like 11. I just thank God that I wasn't stuck. Um, I just I just thank God I got home safely. And the convention still ended. And on a good note, I just thank God for everything, for my experience. For oh, okay.